I'm Daniel Prusner, and I'm an Applications Engineer. Today we're going to be talking about wide input range power supplies. A lot of customers in an industrial setting or in a smart meter need very wide input range power supplies, uh, switches that are very robust that can withstand very high voltage spikes uh, in noisy environments. Fairchild has a series of switches that we are promoting, emitter switch bipolar cast code, or ESBC. The ESBC is well suited for industrial automation, uh, environments where you have a high voltage rail but you also need um, additional standby power. We've also seen a number of smart meter customers embrace the ESBC because it can withstand large transients, such as lightning strikes on the grid. The ESBC is an emitter switch bipolar cast code configuration. That means it has a high voltage BJT on the top side and a MOSFET on the bottom side. The ESBC by its nature is very easy to drive. The switch is comprised of a bipolar transistor on top of a very low voltage MOSFET. It's actually the low voltage MOSFET that the controller drives. In the ESBC configuration, you're driving the low voltage MOSFET, and so you don't need any additional drivers or any additional silicon or hardware in order to drive the whole switch. The ESBC can also be driven in a number of different ways, with both a DC bias on the base, as well as with current transformers for a higher performance needs. We have a number of different wattages, ranging from eight watts to 80 watts in application designs. In this operation, it allows us to take a BJT that would originally be for 800 volts, and it can be used as a 1600 volt breakdown switch. So here we have a demo of the ESBC switch in action. This is an eight watt supply that takes a very wide input range and produces 24 volts out. On the oscilloscope here, we can see the switching waveforms and in a few moments we'll toggle through and show how the supply responds. In this demonstration, we have a power supply hooked up to a, uh, a varying input voltage. Right now we have it set for 250 volts, and we can see that it's um, switching and catching the different valleys. This is a quasi-resonant supply. We can step through and increase the voltage up, hitting 500 and 700, as well as 1,000 volts. So as I step it, we can see here the supply responds very quickly and continues operating, delivering the load. We've just looked at the 8-watt solution, but our applications labs have also created a 30-watt and an 80-watt design, so it covers a wide range of power. For more information about our solutions uh, on ESBC, you can go to our website at fairchildsemi.com. I'm Daniel Prusner. Thank you.